What's that now? Don't like the cold? Can't stay in today. We have a ritual to perform, you and I. your name, girl. But will the goddess speak it back? Normally it would be the mother who declares, if you had one. The whole village would attend and matriarchs perform the ritual, but we are outcasts. Even so, we keep the tribe's rituals. Otherwise, we might become like the faithless old ones who turned their backs on the gu- But their wickedness doomed them. To us, we're left the splendors of creation, beasts of air, water, earth and steel. It is one thing to hunt a beast, another to hunt a machine. You must be humble and respect their power. I will teach you this. One day. No, 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 off your knees. It's nearly time. And yes, you may speak to me. You came to bless the naming. Have not six months gone by since we entrusted her to you. But we are outcasts. You by choice. And she, well... I am a high matriarch, Rost. I bless whom I choose. Then you honor us. Yes, yes, now go and be ready to declare. Go! Oh, mother, this child needs a name by which to know her. That your love may warm her life as the rising sun warms all the earth. Speak her name! <laughs> and so her name is blessed. Stop this at once! What have you done? I've blessed the naming of a child. Stubborn woman, you call that curse a child? What did she tell you about his birth outcast? Answer! I've done only what you asked. To raise it, yes. We said nothing of love. Enough. And you, blessing its name like it was one I of I know my duty to them. Pride. And to you. Without consultation. I'm here. And wherever you go, I will follow.
everybody, welcome back to another episode of Planet Craft 2 and this is the first episode of Horizon Zero Dawn. Now, I'm never going to include Zero Dawn as it's a bit too long. So this is Horizon Episode 1 and well, I'm starting again. I don't, I don't know why I'm going to do it but I feel like I've seen everything in the game and my reactions well, are just wow. Right, this game is amazing. But let's um, let's start again. I might keep that world, but uh, never really go on it when I'm recording. So I don't know what happens most of maybe a bit through the game. Right, the first like six, seven hours, six, seven, eight hours for it. But um, it's going to be in a um, what do you call it? It's going to be future, well not futuristic, but very fantasy sci-fi game very beautiful only out for ps4 though and it's an exclusive on ps4 in the store but uh, I, f I think you get free well it's, you don't get free I paid like 16 pounds for it not even that I don't think but this this game's worth more than it's put on the market and well I'm kind of glad I got this game and the person who well they never like gave it and it said, oh, you should buy it or get this game. I was like, no, it's... Oh, it doesn't... What I might need to do is add the first little clip in. You're quite the gatherer, aren't you, little bast? Now go and see if you can find some more, hmm? Well done, that's a good boy. Children, come with me. She's an outcast to be shunned. Horrible. Oh. Come on. Oh. Sorry for the PS4. Come on, come on. So that's our character there. If you didn't um, already. Down here. Rost. If you didn't already Rost. find out or guess. He won't hear me. Some kind of cake. Here's all. Alright, so this oh, game we start for. Alright, so from getting as a child. Um, so I press circle there. Like as you can see, this is beautiful. Look at that. Look at the detail. Look at the glow. The, I'm pretty sure here soon there'll be like little little bit places. Look at that. That is beautiful. Like how the water shines. I like how there's like focus points and bats up there. I never noticed that first time. The bats, oh, and the rats. Bats and rats, they go together. Alright, so I'm not good. There's a jump right here. Not really a jump right, just bats. Alright, so I'm gonna like kind of skip. Not really go. What's that? As it's still nice. Right, so this is what we need, uh, uh, I can't remember what you call it, but you need this throughout the game, or at least that's what she calls it. 
come on, come on, come on. It's beautiful, this game. A rate of 5 out of 5. So, basically, they're going tribal. So, alright, she didn't, she didn't outcast her. She was born with no mother. And, yeah, she's. Well, she's in a tribe, but not in it. Like she still follows the rules sometimes. Fights everywhere. So I'm not really going to get. I'm I'm going to try not um talk too much, but no, I'm going to try also not to. I'm going to try not to talk for the gameplay, but I'm, well, the gameplay, the a metal door closed. Maybe this device I found can help. A shape. It's connected to the door somehow. Right, she's a smart girl. Even I wouldn't have figured that out. Even at my age. But anyway, this is a 5 out of 5 game for me. The only thing what, um, what people have got complaints about. But other than that, it's beautiful. I don't remember needing anything in here. Uh, you only, I wish there were like more interaction for this. Maybe that later in the line, down the line. There is, but this is really like the most interaction, um, interaction though, part for like the uh, the focus that you get. Like you kind of just see doors and like all this. So let's go. The girl's smart. I've got to give her that. So there's these things here. What are voice? Uh, lines. Uh, did it give me it? All right, yeah. We've not came across anything here. Um, notebook. All right, okay. So, take it. We'll have to go back and do that. Get that one sometime. I might get it in a second. All right, okay. So for this one, we've got to do that. This way, it's the best I can do. He's right behind you. Hi! <laughs> Happy birthday, Isaac. Daddy sure does love his little big man. Look, Daddy can't be there with you and Mom, but we can still have a party, right? <laughs> sure we can. <laughs> Show me. Show me again. I can do. <laughs> Happy birthday, Isaac. Daddy sure does love his little big man. Look, Daddy can't be there with you and Mom, but we can still have a party, right? <laughs> sure we can. <laughs> Happy birthday, Isaac. Daddy sure does love his little big man. All right. Well, that was a little touchy. So nothing in here. I didn't really check um, as much as I did, or should have, or really could have. But um, yeah, this is what this is a way out. Find a way out. So we went through there, went through there. Probably had was there. That came out this way. Probably top to bottom. I'm not very sure right now. But anyway, let's keep going. Uh, there's nothing. Here is there? No. I, I know I was going to like speed through this bit. Bless me. Jesus. Um, right, let's go this way. Right, I know there's something here. If you get like chances in games to explore, make sure you always explore. 
Wait, maybe not if you're under fire. Come on. Have I already got it? No, it doesn't save anything from previous games. That would be silly. Let's try this way. I saw them lining up in the community room. Like cattle in a slaughterhouse, but smiling at each other. Trying to hand you a mess. Being alive is some kind of pain to be eased. Not me. I don't want to go quiet. I don't want to trail off. I want a period at the end of my life sentence, not an ellipsis. An exclamation mark. So if that upsets whoever finds this, too bad. I don't know anyone, anything, anymore. But that, that was that hard. It's just and Machu Picchu. Always wanted to see that. Never did. Why didn't I go with Owen when he asked? Stupid. I mean, seriously. Record our thoughts for posterity. Great idea, Director Evans. Like I haven't done enough for posterity already. Like I wouldn't be here like this if not for posterity. I'm done with posterity. Posterity can go. Here we go. There's Ross. He found me. Ross found me. Do you need anything? I'm coming. Come, girl. Take my hand. You don't belong down there. Such places are forbidden, Aloy. What is that on your face? Nothing. Did you find it down there? No. Give it to me. No. Aloy, such things are dangerous. No! All right. He's really controlling. It's making him seem guilty. Well, if you're gonna go sneaking away from home, you'll need to know how to survive in the wild. Come, Aloy. Home now. Starting tomorrow, you will learn to hunt. to that plaything. We descend to the valley now. Follow. All right. So, um, it in here. The wilds can be dangerous, Aloy. 
You will need to stay close and do as I say. I know, I know. Now, you're still scratched up from that fall you took yesterday. So let's start there. Take this medicine pouch, and I'll show you how to fill it. See this plant over here? I it's did. called salve brush. Come, gather its berries in your pouch. Good. Now eat the berries. They may taste bitter, but they can save your life. Always they can. keep your pouch full of medicinal berries, flowers, and plants. All right. So as he's Here wondering, comes. this valley is just a part of all mothers' embrace. Embrace. The Nor tribe watches these lands and keeps out the most dangerous machines, usually. Boars and wristers. I know they're not wristers, but can't remember what they're actually called. Rabbits, tur turkeys. That's what they're called. Further down river, you'll find a herd of machines, and I will teach you how to hunt. Are they dangerous? All, All machines, machines are dangerous. Their power must be respected. And I will be beside you. I hear lots of people saying that in this game. That's the only thing I can remember. Anyway, a machine's coming. Crouch and follow me into the tall grass. <coughs> now stay low. No, Aloy. Such machines are called watchers. You must learn to avoid their gaze. If you are to survive in the wilds, I will show you. Listen close and do as I do. Stay still. Wait for it to pass. Now keep low and follow me across the trail to that tall grass. Oh, another one. Let it pass. Alright, so I am a danger, so it kind of helps to disguise. The slower you move, the quieter you be. And crouch right. walking is quieter than upright. So if you see a line at the top, uh, like the compass, Wait for it. it means that you can't be, like you're not making any notes. If there's an eye with one, two, or three, it means like you could be heard. That's the last of them. Let's move on. Like three being the loudest, one being like the quiet, well, the second quietest, and now we could get up. I want to see this if he does this now. He did well. They didn't see oh no. Alright, okay, so, okay, so this is what he did before, and then I'll go back to the present. Yeah. Right, I might actually. Now stay close. That herd should be just ahead. The little bit from um, the first time I played it. Because he did it like a funny move. That's well, not funny, but it was. That's funny. Who's that? Ignore him. But why is he up there? Name's Tail or something? He's smiling at us. Deb! Get back to the Ignore him. We are outcasts and he is of the tribe. Maybe he doesn't like the tribe. And he is a fool. Come now. Let's find that herd. Follow. Alright, let's get this. A little bit in of that rich wood. All right, that first jump there. was too over dramatic. These are called striders. Ha! Get! Why'd you chase them off? Huh. I'll show you how some machines startle easily if they detect you and run away. They're best approached by stealth. Don't worry. We'll catch up with them further down the valley. You'll see. Discover these rocks. These rocks last me a lifetime. Little. Right, come on. Let's just get these. Sit. 
Oh, medicine. So you get medicine, rocks and wood, uh, mainly on the ground. Alright, okay, you can't. Come on, you. Come on, Stork. Now, I want you to find some rocks that fit the cup of your hand. Why? Do as I say, Aloy, and gather the rocks. I will show you how to use them. Where Those will do. Follow. Yeah, I'm following. You should be following. The marks around die shows how much. Now, if you're. Yeah, I've already discussed this game. You should tell me that when you're. Uh, discussing the game. There's there we go. Herd. All right. It's time to throw some rocks. But rocks can't hurt machines, right? No. But they can distract them, draw them into traps. Let that watcher over there. It must be dealt with. Or we'll warn the herd and send them running before we get in range. Warn them? How? The machines speak to each other, Aloy. Unless they are first silenced. Now you stay here on the ridge. On my signal, throw rocks and draw the watcher over to me. Wait for my signal. Easy. Oh. Did that. Um, Tissu? Come girl, it's safe now. I'm coming. So for like the large part of this um, game, I'm probably going to be quiet. Um, as I've thought of a new way of like recording. Harvest the kill so I can teach you how to make arrows. Well, give me a minute. Ross, so he's actually not my dad. If, well, yeah, you'll see in a second. Use the stocks as arrow shafts and metal shards for arrowheads. Good. You'll never run out of arrows if you know how to craft what you need. Let's put those arrows to use. Follow. Here. Stay low in the grass and be quiet. Well, it's so small, doesn't it? It's time to make your first kill. Strider, one of the weaker machines, but even a weak machine can kill a hunter if she's careless. You must study it. Its hide is thick, but there are spots where it is vulnerable, like its eye. Can you guess another? Of course, it's the canister on its back. The canister on its back. Is that a weakness? How did you guess that? Keep firing! Right, not the best. You did well today, but you have much to learn. Tomorrow, we train again. What was that? That boy. The one running the brave trails. Follow Eloy, quick! Right, come on, come on, come on, let's go, let's help our friend. Well, he might be a friend. Ross, faster! You, you've not even... Oh, leave the quest... How am I leaving the quest area? Come on. Alright, he runs as fast as I do. I'm going to do this other channel because, well, you get there as the same. Do nothing. 
only a matter of time before the machines find that boy and kick him to death. But if I shoot, it will cause a stampede and it will trample him. So. But I can see the path they take. Stop telling stories. I'm not. I can sneak through. You will not. Uh, you've done it now, haven't you? you took my boy away. And I got as wise aloys, but things, and uh, what arms? That's what you call them, arms. So and um, small. Do this slowly and quiet. Alright, so we're gonna wait until he passes by. But yeah, if you were looking for the bishop, you would not see anything. They probably did redhead because of this. Come on, you, come on. Oh, wait, I could have went for kind of. But oh well, we'll go for now. Can't let them see me. Uh, Got let's selfie this. I need to see their paths. Almost I kind, there. kind of know what's going to happen where they are. Right, so now it's safe. But still crouch. There we go, talk to Ted. Hey. What? What was this? Alright, let's go this way. I'm a magician, kid. I'm a redhead. That my excuse. How are you doing this? How is this possible? There we go. Mother, bless that girl. Bless you both. She, Boy! She saved me. I, I just wanted... Boy! Seal your lips! They are outcasts both. And she is motherless. Ooh. Come now. Back to Mother's heart. Ouch. Don't you hate when your dad does it? Why should not have spoken to us? It's against tribal law. We'll go home now. Follow. I know the way. the boy at the start stay away no mother Ooh. oh now we've got three options now and um, I'm not going to read through them it's aim for the head drop the rock drop your rock or knock the rock from his head and uh, I picked um, aim for the head that dad actually 
uh, with his bow shoots it. Uh, drop the rock. I think he'll probably do it again and knock the rock from his hand is what I did and then what I'm going to do. He gets a bit satisfied from me. My mother. Aloy, I've told you before, that's not for us to know. You were just a newborn when the matriarchs brought you to me. So the matriarchs, they know? <sighs> it's not so simple. But they know. Aloy, we are outcasts. So how do I make them tell me? The matriarchs? Well, there is a way, perhaps. So tell me. It will be dangerous. How? It would take years of training. I don't care. How do I do it? Tell me. The proving. The tribe's rite of passage held every year. Those who pass become braves. But to the one who wins, the matriarchs grant a boon. A boon? Yes, whatever the winner wants. Then I'll do it. <laughs> whatever it takes. I'll win the proving. Come on, Ross. We best get started then. Yeah. The training will be hard. I know it will take years. Start training? Yes. Follow. Oh, I love Evast. Epic fight scene. Well, training scene. For me. I know she doesn't have any footwear when she's younger. Are they? They're they. I'm hitting the targets now. I wonder how Ross gets up there. I'm gonna try and not call him dad. As I did with like the other one. I thought you had a um, headphone movement. Probably one of a good uh, movement and good moving on. Now she's an adult. I reckon 27. But in some scenes, um, her, you know, she looks a lot younger. Cinematics, they're way better than natural gameplay. No, I, I wouldn't mind for cinematics to be like a whole game or like 75% of the game. Like, you know, traveling places, that would be way better. Ross? days before the proving and he goes off without me? He wouldn't do that. Alright, so I guess that's going to be um, this episode. I'm going to end it off here. We've got some skills and I guess um, right now, healer 
critical hit and precision or silent con concentration silent strike might be good uh, I'm trying to think of what helps me most um, well these are quite easy so I've had a lot more uh, time to practice with the bow since I've been um, like playing this game quite a lot a good few hours or days my well not days more more than hours and days there's uh, a few more we've got the two common ones these are quite common uh, the striders will the striders will come in use soon oh so that's what the cauldron is all right okay sorry i'm trying not to give too much away actually we only like explore like for the first bit is like all the way here that's our first main bit we don't go there we don't go back here that's right we, I think we go there once do we no I don't think so but anyway guys I hope you enjoyed this episode episode one uh, I think that's actually the room where we came out of I don't know it's hard to tell in these games because there's so much open area if you think it's a big map it really isn't like this kind of I don't know this here it's like a head and hands and his body's probably maybe like back there and then what could this be like a like a puppet kind of thing with big eyes you know, that's his like mouth I don't know that's just kind of some things oh his eyes are there if they're looking like here maybe like one of those like maybe you know, one with like eyes at the top, some cartoony kind of thing. I don't know. I try to look for shapes or like things. Like here could be a mouse, hands, ears, face, ears, no feet, here, ears, no head, and like a leg. And then that's his body, and it doesn't show you the rest. I always wish you could turn your um on your map but uh, let's go back and guys I hope you enjoyed episode one thank you all for watching planet craft 2 over and out and start you to hear the ps4 and um, i'm going to keep this um video as one one whole video but every video from maybe from now on depends how i feel would be cut down and edited maybe not maybe some i might leave whole some i'll cut down but I think it'll be more enjoyable for you to cut down. I might like, well, like, all right. So it'll be more enjoyable for you to watch cut down. But I think some people with inspiration like this would like to see the full thing. And yeah, guys, I hope you enjoyed. I hope you're staying safe for these times. And please excuse my reading and my capability of speaking. But guys, thank you all for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Stay safe. Like that too. Over and out. Goodbye.